Just watching uh, Caleb Williams talk about Colorado, and he had a lot of good things to say. He said he looks forward to playing them. And he said that he, um, this Colorado team, even though they brought in about 60 some players, it kind of remind him of when him and Leak and Riley came into uh, USC. They brought some players in as well. And um, he said he looked forward to the matchup. There's no trash talking. Um, he said right here, they've done a good job to say the least. They have like 60 to 70 new players. Kind of like we did last year, Williams said after practice on Wednesday. He said they've done a great job going 3-0. and It's not the same team that we played last year. Obviously, not the same coaching staff and players. And we have to understand it's going to be a good game, and I'm excited to play them. So this is not that situation where we had with um, the state game, Colorado State. It was some talking back and forth. Even the, the Nebraska game. It's not personal. He said they're just going in to handle business. And um, it's, I think it's going to be a really good game. And I'm not sure how the turnout is going to be. But I do know that Colorado Colorado has some things to work on to protect Shador Sanders. I think that's the main key thing is to pro protect Shador Sanders leading up to this game, trying to figure that out. I'm sure they're working on that. And, um, you know, as far as the points and stuff, what I think it, I think it's potentially have a, a chance to be a close game and a competitive game. USC is very tough. They have um, Lloyd, the running back, Brendan Rice. Um, they, they have a lot of um, weapons on that team. Kayla Williams, obviously, Heisman Trophy winner. So they're going to bring it Um definitely the buffaloes have to be on their toes you know what i mean it's um it's a game like that but it's this game it, this is the game that i marked on my calendar though like i can't wait for this game you know it's a home game and um you know colorado has not lost at home all year so they definitely got the home field advantage and uh but shout out to caleb williams for showing respect you know he said listen um He's seeing what they're doing over there. He's seeing all the attention and all that. And um, he's looking forward to playing them. And there's no trash talking and stuff like that. So I'm glad. I just want to see them do the talking with their play. Now, as far as the status, I'm not sure if Shiloh is going to play. Shiloh is going to play. But I'm, I'm sure he probably will. I know after the last game, he complained about kidney issues. And um, he had to get that treated. I think Travis Hunter said he's going to be on the sidelines for this game. I know a lot of celebrities are going to be there and things like that. All these games, the Buffaloes play is going to be big this year, you know. But, um, yeah, man, I can't wait for this game, man. But, like I said, the main key ingredient is they have to protect Shador Sanders. That's the key ingredient, man. But what say you guys? Drop a comment below. Let me know how you feel. I will talk to you on the next one. Peace. Thanks for watching, guys. But before you go, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell notification so you can get updated on my latest content as it drops. If you have any video ideas, feel free to leave a comment below. Take care.